Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel and back to Planet Zoo Career Mode where we are stepping right on into the fourth scenario. So this one is called Eye of the Taiga, Maple Leaf Wildlife Park. Looks like it's a medium level difficulty. This bordering Candy Lake, the site of the Maple Leaf Wildlife Park was chosen for its outstanding views of natural beauty. In giving you this opportunity, Bernard has done you a great honor. So it's time to repay the trust that he's placed in you and do him proud. I don't know, Bernard. <laughs> I'm going to tell y'all that um, I I have not played this since we did the Panda Park. Like, I'm really bad. I think before I do the next one, whatever this is, Crater, crater Lengths, go to Crater Lengths, um, I might go back and redo these last, like all four of them in a row. Because I think with this game, the more you do it, the better you are. That's how I was with um, Planet Coaster. Like the more I played it, I remembered things more. So I might do that before we jump into the fifth one. But anyway, let's get started. Cause I'm yabbering. After your sterling work in China, I got a bit of a good news, better news situation for you. The good news is that I'm promoting you to apprentice zoo manager. The better news is, you get to build a new zoo from scratch. That said, you will be on your own this time. No help from Nancy, although she wishes you luck. So, I suppose it's actually more of a good news, better news, and then mm, slightly worse news situation. Either way, it's a chance for you to really prove yourself. Now... For this zoo, I'll want to see a good few different habitat and exhibit species, and at least as many guests, to look at them. I'd also like you to keep your staff nice and happy as much as you can. And obviously, the same's true of the animals as well. Oh, and, uh, let's see. Uh, yeah, you should try to turn a good-sized profit to boot, so we can continue our vital work elsewhere. There. That should keep you going for a while. <laughs> I'll check in with you later. Good luck. Oh my gosh. I didn't know <laughs> that they were throwing you in here. Like, oops. Sorry. So, like, am I just on my own? Like, just flat out on my own? Oh gosh. Okay. So, I guess... I guess pause. Let's pause to see what we have. We have, okay, this is the entrance. It's a nice little entrance going on. So then it looks like over here we have the vet, uh, staff room, research center. What is this? Trade center. Vet, animal trade, keeper hut, quarantine, and staff room. Okay. All right, so good. Well, at least they put all of that in here for us but yeah y'all we are on okay i'm a little nervous i didn't realize that that is what they were doing okay so it says here you need a research center oh we don't have a research center okay so we need a research center and we need a workshop why wouldn't they just put it here Okay, that's fine, but let's go ahead and start. Oof, okay, so the first thing is we need to have three habitat species in the zoo and then have at least 175 guests. Oh man, I, I, feel, I feel put on the spot. Okay, so first they're gonna come in here and we kind of want something to... I want... I think I want the habitat like over here somewhere and then put like things like drinks and whatnot here. That's what I'm thinking. So let's start with animal trading because we need to know what animals we can even get at this point. Is this it? Seriously? Okay. I'm not going to pay too much attention. I'm not, not going to try to be too, like, particular when it comes to 
the animal, um, like going to all the stats right now and everything. Because I mean, let's be real. Even though I've been playing for years, I still don't really know how to play this game appropriately. <laughs> uh, okay. So fertility, I do want some, I want good fertility though. I don't want bad Im immunity. Longevity. Jeez, I, I feel like none of these are good. So I guess you're fine. The black wildebeest. So this is a female. Okay. So let's adopt. And then male. I don't like that immunity. I guess this one is fine. Yeah. Compare mate. Mother. Gene potential. Yeah, that's not bad. If I even did that right. Um, all right, so this one, so adopt. Okay, so then what I wanna do is go to animal storage. Yep, we have those two in there. Um, let's look at exhibit trading now. Cause I kinda wanna do like maybe two exhibits. Maybe a diamondback turtle. Does that count though? It says habitat species, but that's fine. We we can do we can do a turtle. Let's do a diamondback turtle. That was a female. I should have checked. Yeah, okay, female. But then let's get a male. Eight point six, eight point one, but your fertility is bad. Ooh, you're young. Three point one. Think I'm gonna do this one. Yeah, let's just go for that one. Okay, so we're gonna have one habitat. So then let's go to the Zoopedia and search for black wildebeest. So let's check what we'll need for it. The so grassland biome. It needs, okay, it doesn't really, okay, this is a good one. No climbing, no water, we're gonna give it water, but no climbing, no water, and no deep water requirement. So we need to make sure it has 410 land requirement and then needs grade two boundary with four point. Okay, I'm gonna, hold on. So let's put this up to like, ooh, you know what, hold up. Species data, group size. One male, okay, so we only can have one male, but up to 31 females. So, and the group size can be 732. So let's just look at if we have like 10, let's just go with 10. So 770. So I'm thinking if we, if we incorporate, once we do the water in the landscaping, Let's go for like a thousand to somewhere between a thousand and two thousand of space. Yeah, somewhere between a thousand and two thousand of space. I'm gonna go with, and then let's go back to species data. All right, ooh, lots of interspecies enrichment. So we gotta think about that too. You gotta think about that. But not right now, because they said we need two habitats. So like basically we can't co-mingle right now, otherwise it won't count towards our goal. So I'm not gonna worry about that. Okay. All right, y'all. Let's let's go. Let's go in here and figure it out. Um don't want to guess gate. Hmm. What's the resistance again? I know something told me to take a picture, y'all. I'm to take a picture. Grade two, okay. Barriers, grade two. So the wood, we can start with the wood, I guess. That's grade three. And start with that. Now let's do, uh, how do you snap to path? All right, let's just start. I want to do curved. I kind of want to do like, I want to go this way. Something like this. Mm 
Okay. Then let's come out this way, but then I want to like... Can I drag? Uh, eight. Do 15? Hello? Come on. Oh gosh, that is not what I wanted. Why is it curving inward like that? Don't do that. Uh-uh. How do I go back? Delete. Thank you. Delete. Delete. Here we go. Okay. Here we go. Y'all, this is not going to be pretty. Not going to be pretty, but I don't care. <laughs> we just trying to learn here, okay? We just learning. All right, so what is in the habitat gate? So this is going to be for the staff. So I'm going to have that over here. Because the staff is going to kind of come. Like we're going to like make a path right here for the staff. So what what is this? Um, For right now, what is this? You know what? It's fine. It's fine. So let's do, for now, let's just do this. And then let's go to our remember, 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 remember. Remember, 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 animals. Yes, okay. Trade center, where's my trade center? Animal trading. Animal storage, here you go, okay. Then to zoo. No path, oh. Yes, yes. Staff path, uh, let's just do the basic staff path for now. I'm not too concerned. Yep, that's fine. All right, Santa Zoo, one, and then two. Okay, so then let's uh, fast forward for them to get in here so that we can then see what um, we're working with. With them, let's, one, two, three, here we go. So they should be, yep, here they come. Well, here it comes, I guess. We're checking our staff too. I have no idea what our staff looks like. All right, so we have one. What inspector? Please don't break out. Just don't don't break out yet. Just wait until the, the, the next one comes in here, please. No vets, okay. All right, pause. Cool. Okay, so now we can click on the animal and see what we're working with here. Terrain. So we're at, we're at 1303. Personally, I would like to make this a tad bigger. How do I do that? It's at two. And I think, hold on, did I take a picture? I did not. Zoopedia. 4.125. Okay. So we definitely need to important alerts to require attention. You know what? Hold on. I like the whole thing. There we go. All right. 4.1 something. So let's just go to like 4.1. Three, okay, that's high enough. Okay, okay, okay. So then let's look at glass. Transparent. Oh, we don't have a, oh, we don't have um two-way glass just yet. That's fine. So let's make Oh wait, no, 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 no. I don't want the, oh no, undo. Okay, I didn't want all of that. I just wanted like these three maybe, glass. Yeah, for now, 
it's those three glass okay all right and then oh and i want to make this bigger how do i make how do i make this bigger how do i make this bigger what is this uh what what do you want what do you want zoo you have no keepers okay and no vets all right thank you um i'm pretty sure crap. i am messing up okay i'm is it no okay i figured out how to do how to make it oh here we go yes okay awesome all right so i want to make it like gonna break okay that's fine let's just do it like this okay and then maybe what we do is we can make another staff path around this side and turn this one into um to glass too but for now let's just do it like this and actually i want to move and i highlight those two and then Why is this so difficult? Okay. That's fine. Whatever. Whatever. Okay. 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 Now let's go to Tara. Oh, wait. Hold on. Let's check first. We're still at 1303. How the heck are we still at 1303 when I just made it bigger? Oh wait, play. Aha, yep, calculating. Okay, 1682, great. Okay, that's what I wanted. All right, so now let's go to, uh, wait a minute. <gasps> Have they limited me? Disabled, wow. So we can't do water. Okay, then never mind. Let's just focus on, all right, so hard shelter. So habitat shelter um what's it called wildebeest all right so wildebeest can have eight by eight by four eight by eight by four yeah let's do this one the eight by eight by four and we're gonna put it away from the glass because the point is you want people to be able to like look and see the shoot. Y'all, how do I rotate? You want people to be able to see them, but you don't oh, hold on. Okay, Z. <laughs> All right. So let's go ahead and put the hard shelter kind of like back like back here, but to where the guests can still see it, I guess. Is that good? No. Uh, maybe like, you know what? Hold on. Uh, X. Yes. Look at me. Look at me remembering. Here we go. Okay. Now I want to go back to this and then just flush it up against. Yep. 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 Okay. All right. So let's go back to this. Let's hit play. And we can see if hard shelters enough. Yes. Okay. Oh, thank you. We're doing it, y'all. We're doing it. <laughs> um, okay, we're doing it, but it looks like it's kind of in the grass. Like, why is why is the grass like? You know what? That's fine. Let's put it like this, because what we can do is we can um change the terrain. Yeah, we can change the terrain. All right, so habitat. Let's just do habitat small, large. Yeah. Let's just get some um, some of this in here. Like on one side, maybe, and that should be fine. All right, so let's click again. So we're good on shelter, we're good on terrain. They're perfect on space. There is not enough 
uh, short grass. So terrain, grass, short. So let's just kind of, all right, so that's good. We're now on the right and there's not enough soil. So soil, let's get, uh, maybe we put the soil around their habitat here. Just on this side. All right, so soil's perfect. Okay, y'all we doing it. Okay. Terrain's looking good. Uh, plant coverage, actually, hold on, let's play and then pause. All right, terrain coverage looks fine. But let's go ahead and look at some plants. So we need some Africa plants from the grassland biome. So now we have that. So me clicking on this and that did the automatic filter. So that's what I was doing here. I'm not gonna do too much terrain. Cause like I said, I'm. this is not meant to be, um, I'm, I, I don't, I'm, I'm not a, a, a builder. Like I'm not one of those people that you're gonna be like, oh, like, I kind of want to put multiple, like, oh, she builds such beautiful, um, uh, M. How do I get, okay, there we go. Be like, oh, she builds such beautiful, um, things. Like, nope, not me. I, I don't know how to do duplicate. I'm going to say, okay. Oh, it, it did it automatically. Okay. So let's kind of do like this and then cancel. Okay, so you kind of some trees over there. That's nice. And then maybe do another cork oak. Here. Okay. All right, I'm liking it. I'm liking it. Um, and then maybe do some, is there a bigger one? Medium? This is the largest. Okay. Oh, woo. Kind of big. The trees, I don't want trees. Can I do, let's do some rocks, let's do some rocks. So rock one, okay, this is fine. This is fine. We gotta make sure they can't like get on it or something. So maybe put the rock here. Like you don't, you don't want it too close to, um. Okay, you don't want it too close to the edge because then they might be able to climb over it. All right, so then we put this one. Maybe bring this up a little bit. And then put this one, bring it down a little bit more. Okay. Now let's look at these plants. Kind of small. No, I don't want that. Um, large. They're not like bigger plants. Tree. Two, four. What's the? Oh, yes, 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 yes. Okay. So may okay. Thinking maybe. Uh, here. Didn't mean to do that. And then, uh, duplicate, okay. Okay. Let's kind of repeat over here. Yeah. I don't know what I'm doing, y'all. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. So, if you have any tips or, oh gosh, if you have any tips or tricks, um, I am most graciously accepting of, of whatever it is you can offer. I'm trying to get it out of the Okay, so that one's fine, but now we got to get this one out of the daggone wall.
X, turn it, X again, sitting X to, to change it from, you know, up, down, sideways, and then rotating. All right, so now let's just get this one, X. Uh, let's X again to rotate. We want the green one. And X again. Nope, actually, X again. All right, I think we want that one. And then X and get it. Okay, that, that's fine. It's not perfect, but it works for me. Um, okay, nature. But maybe just do some pretty African daisies kind of like around here a little bit. You know? We like that. Just because, you know, people can mm -mm, do it over here. Just because people can see it. All right, and then let's do one more. And then one more, actually. Rotate. This one might be a, a, a one, two, three, four, ten parter, y'all, because <laughs> there's a lot going on. I didn't realize we were gonna um, get stuck. Uh, maybe do, nah, I don't want trees. I feel like it's enough shrubbery. I don't want to take away from the land. Like, remember it was 1600? What is it now? Okay, it's, oh wait, nope. Play. And then pause. See, it's calculating. Now it's 1519. Okay, that's fine, you know, because I do want to put another animal in here. Okay, so plants coverage is not, okay, grass and plants is not too much. That's fine. Can I, can I, I can't do any terrain manipulation. Like I can't even do, you know, to make it some valleys and some hills. Can't do none of that. They're like, nope. All right. We probably don't have any enrichment because we don't have research. Too few adults. All right. So we, we need them to be able to breed. Yeah. We need them to be able to breed. Otherwise they're not going to be happy. But that's fine. All right. Uh, now let's go to habitat and food and water. Let's get a large water bowl. Wait, that's not large. Water bowl large. Okay, it is. Water trough small. Water trough large. Let's do this one. So let's put this one kind of like over here. To where like the guests, if they want, can see it. They can stand here and see them have some water and then we can do a large food one. Didn't mean to do that. Cancel. A large the reason why I did that, y'all, is because I was if you're if you're highlighting something and then you click on something new, um, it's typically gonna place it like right there. I, it didn't do it that time, but I think that's what keeps happening. And then let's put like the food over here so that people can kind of come over here and see them eating. Okay. So they're good. They they have they have what they need to survive <laughs> for now. So what we need to do now is go to facilities. Um, yeah, there's so much. There's so much now in this game. Like they added these, these animal talks, which is cool. Um, and they add a couple of other stuff too. But I'm like, I don't even know if I can remember everything that they've added in this thing. I'm not even going to try. All right. So we need to check because we've made it so far away. Let's check if our gate has power. That would be nice. Um, how do I do that again? Heat maps. Here we go. Power. Yes. Okay. So here's something else that they changed, y'all. 
If any part of your habitat has power, the whole habitat has power. So even though our door isn't in that starter power grid here, because that little smidgen, we lucked up, this smidgen of wall has power, that means our gate has power. Talk about lucky. Let's also look at the traversable terrain habitat. Here we go. Traversable terrain. Okay. Select animal to show. So let's click the animal. All right. So this is showing that the animal. Mm, okay. So the animal can pretty much go all over its habitat. It's not going to be able to climb up here. Not going to be able to climb up any of this stuff. But look at this. This is not traversable. The middle is, but not the sides. And I'm not sure why. Not sure why. Um, what happens if I move it up a little bit? Select animal. That didn't do anything. Let's take a look. Why would the outsides not be traversable? You know, that's fine. It, it has traversable terrain. All right, so it's not going anywhere. Okay, so what was I doing? I actually didn't even do what I said I was gonna do. This donation box. So we wanna put the donation box right here, right up against the path. So, mm, move. I don't wanna put it in the middle. Yep, okay. So we want that. Um, oh man, if I, it's not gonna have power. If I put this, the, the educational board, I don't think it's gonna have power. Let's see. See if it has power. Get it here. Uh, ah, okay. I didn't think this through. <laughs> I didn't think this through, y'all. I didn't think it through. So we're just not going to have that for now. That's not ideal, but I don't want to have to do how I don't want to have to do um, what you call it? A power thing like that's gonna mess up our money right now um but look they added the educational station height giraffe so you put this down and like the kids can measure themselves uh, one for a gorilla i know you can't you know what Hold on. get rid of the heat map here we go it's a giraffe one there's the gorilla one you gotta put there you go the gorilla one create the giraffe one the giraffe one and they have these um stock uh station paw prints so basically like kids can see like oh my hand is as big as a whatever and then they have this one a soundboard isn't this cute but they're adding such cute stuff to this game okay so um that's unfortunate that we weren't able to do that but i'm okay with it for now so how about this let's do an animal talk which does it need power? Yup. Because you see, if, if I put it out here, it's red. If I put it here, it's blue. So how about this? Let's put an animal talk here. Because essentially what can happen is he can get like, they can kind of still see in here. But then whoever's giving the animal talk can can do it right there. But like if I put these these speakers, oh you know what? I can put this speaker right here, so as they walk up to the habitat of the wildebeest, they can start hearing. Um, they can start hearing it. I don't know if this makes any sense, but I'm doing it. All right, let's hide it under the ground. Okay, cool. So we have that. Now let's do a, let, let's hit play on level one because we want to start having people. Oh no, why are you turning around already? You just got here. Oh boy. Okay, so uh, staff. They're saying we don't have any vets. So let's hire a 
First, let's hire a caretaker, because they're going to take care of that. Let's hire a keeper. I need the one for now. We only have one thingy. Let's go ahead and hire an educator. Don't know if that's smart either, but we're doing it. We obviously need a mechanic. Don't know what happened there. I'm gonna hire security. I think some people say don't do that right away, but whatever. And then we need a vet. Okay, so I think now we have one of each thing. Except for a vendor, we don't we didn't put down any vendors yet, so I'm not concerned about that. Okay. Uh before I do what I wanna do, let's first think about putting down some bins. I'm gonna put a bin right here. And then let's put another bin like right there. And then let's do some benches. Just in case people want to put it like right here, like off to the side. Do a couple of benches. Okay. So let's do guest facilities. Let's get some, get an information center going. I'm going to put that, everything needs to be in here so, so it gets power. Uh, X. Yes. All right. So I kind of want it like this. Yeah, I'm I'm better, aren't I? Like, don't don't tell me I'm not better. <laughs> uh, okay. So can I get a dirt path? What is this path? Natural? Is that what that is? Natural? A natural terrain path? I think so. All right, so we have an information center there. So let's check that out real quick. Prices. They can do adoption pack. So we have adoption pack that they can buy. We have umbrellas they can buy. Okay, and synchronized cost. Yep, let's do that so everything costs the same. All right, so, oh, look, 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 look. We have some um, people. Hello. Oh, you know what I didn't do? Did I hear people do a lot? Zoo overview is change our hours so that it's not as dark. So I think 22 should be fine. Okay, so what is this? Research center and workshop. All right, so, uh, um, power. Oh, I am on power. Okay, so yeah, I can do I can do food over here. Let's do that. So I want to make like a courtyard type thing. So, do like here. And then just kind of come out like that. And then what are we looking like? Okay, good, good, good. We're still in power. And then let's go to facilities. Let's start with food. We can do this one that's already kind of nice. You know what? I probably should have did that for the information center, but you live and you learn. Oh well. Um, let's do this one because it's already built. And then let's kind of move it out. This this just makes it so that like lines um don't clog up. Here we go. Don't clog up the walk the main walkway. Let's do a drink shop. And then let's just kind of put it close, but not. On it. I could have did a grid. I could have did a grid, y'all. So like, that's when you, you see this right here. Like where you put it in grid mode. You know what? I think I'm gonna do that. 
I'm gonna click on this. How do I do it? Ooh. <laughs> um, enter group edit mode. Does it work like that? Facilities. So if I do this, no. Oh boy. Um. I don't know. Hold on. Let, let me try to figure this out. Okay. Here. I overlooked it. Align to grid. So selecting grid. So if I do that, I now have a grid. So I can do... That? I don't think I want to do that, y'all. Can I go back to, okay, never mind. Y'all, let's just forget it. Forget it. <laughs> we gonna learn. We gonna learn, y'all. One day. Didn't mean to do that. We gonna learn one day. It's gonna work out one day. I want it close, but not too close. This is what I'm saying about you got to play. You got to play this game more often so that you don't just be forgetting how to play. All right. So now we have drink. We have food, drink, and then we need toilets. So let's do a toilet. But I don't like putting the toilets right next to the food. We're going to actually put the toilet over here. Mm. Yeah. Nice. They're kind of like in the back of the food. They can come over here and go to there. Now I should be fine. Oh, yes. Perfect. Okay. All right. I'm not seeing any alerts pop up. So that means I think we're doing okay. All right. So people now have bathroom. They have information booth. They have drinks and food. So let's do, here we go. I wanted like a grassy, what's, what's happening? Ah, it's gotta be on a path. What? Since when? Okay. Um. Okay, can I get rid of path support? Yeah, let's take that off. Take off path support. And then align to grid. Do that. I thought I took off path support, but uh, okay. Can I get rid of delete paths? Can I get rid of that? Herb on railing on no. Why am I still getting path support? Curb markers. Curb on ground path. Okay, there we go. All right. So. Deselect grid. Align to grid. Selecting. Selecting grid. I want a different grid. Hello? Oh, okay, I'm off a of delete path now. Align to grid, selecting grid. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. And for some reason, it's just not working out. So yeah, like I'm trying to do align to grid. And it's just doing, it's doing 
stupid thing. Curb on ground path. Like it's still giving me the curb. And I'm like, I told you I don't want a curb. I don't want a curb. So I don't know. I don't know. Can't explain it. All right. So what we're going to do is this. It, it's not pretty. Let's hit play. It's not pretty, but whatever. <laughs> it gets the job done. Um, and then let's just give people a couple of um, spots to sit down. And have something to eat. And let's go ahead and put a trash can like right here. Okay. Oh, these are cute. Patio heater. And then restaurant. Oh, yeah, you can build restaurants now, y'all. I love it. All right, security cameras. We don't want any of that. Okay. Oh, look, 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 look. They, they're using it. <laughs> I love it. This looks like a... Yes. Oh, Anna Lamb. Okay. That's not her. Okay. So people have food. Oh, wait. We didn't do... We didn't um synchronize prices. Okay. So the bathroom profit. You know what? Let's just make the bathroom like 15 cents. And let's see what people say. So they have a bathroom. They have um, food, drink, information booth. Everything is too expensive. Well, I didn't raise the prices, so I'm sorry. All right, so they're coming in. I guess they're going down. So we gotta figure out how to make this better. But what I wanna do first is get, um, it's not gonna be pretty. Like you see how this is nice and pretty? I want, I want it like this. All right, so let's do staff pass. Is it this one? Hold on, y'all. Okay, it's not that. Is it this? Yes, yeah, this. Okay, six. Let's do six. Okay, daytime now. Um, I think it's this. But can I make this? go like this and then kind of meet up with this path over here like that and then i'm probably gonna have to what what is this so this is fake whatever this is they made this edit like whatever this is right here like they made i didn't mean to do that how do i how do I get rid of this? These. I need to move these. Move? Oops. Well, it worked. What is it? Oh, a log wall curved. Okay. Interesting. Long, yeah, log wall curved. Log wall. I don't even see that. So where'd it come from? I don't know, but I've now moved it. So then this right here, can I edit this as well? Move. Quick. And then how do I extend it? Like I want to put it, okay, you know what? I don't know how to do this. I don't know what this is. I don't know where they got it from, but we're moving all of this stuff. So, M, move this shrubbery. Let's move that to the side. Move this one. Move that one. We can go right here. Yeah, that's fine. That is perfectly fine. Just, I need to get out the way. Okay, so we now need facilities. We need a research center. Research center. Get this one, because it's already made. Okay. Okay. Uh, 
Yep, it's already made, so let's just put it right here. Boom. And then what else do we need? A workshop. I think this is for our um vet vet people. Not vet. Maintenance workers. Okay. Alright, let's throw that next to it. Not perfect, but it it's there. Okay. <laughs> it's there. All right, so now actually what we need to do is we need to hire another vet because I think the vets are, we have two caretakers. Oh, okay. But then we need to hire another vet because now, vet research, okay. So now we wanna take one of the vets and put them on research in our black wildebeest. Boom. So that's the plan right there. And now the other one is free to help if something is needed. Okay. So y'all, we are like no way near our objectives. <laughs> we aren't, but I think this is a nice start. I might swap out this information booth but this is kind of ugly. Or maybe next episode, we'll try to actually build something. How about that? How about next episode, we'll we'll try to build something and make it look like something on our own. But we have that. We have our animals. Look at this. They are just racking in. You know what? I should have moved this closer to the curb, but it's fine. But you know what? Because they're over there, we should probably move this right here. Yeah, let's do that. They're, they're congregating over there. So I need you to put the tips in here. And we're getting tips. But look, it's probably going... Oh, look, look. Do you see? Now they're looking here and they're throwing it in there. So yeah, that's fine. They're not even coming this way yet. Just the staff is. But let's check on our wildebeest. So they need some enrichment. We're getting there. We just... We're, we're researching it right now. Terrain is still good. Environment is still good. Um, Once they mate, hopefully... We'll get some more things. But yeah, y'all, this one might be a couple of episodes because I don't want to rush it and then like be bankrupt. You know what I'm saying? Like I really want to, I don't want to get too much into the details, but I also don't want to just be throwing stuff down and it, it don't make sense, you know? But we got some food going on here. People are enjoying the food. They are sitting down and eating. They're enjoying our little facilities right here. We can probably spruce this up at some point. I don't know. But yeah, I guess at 137. So, I mean, that's going down. But next episode, what we can probably do is try to get maybe one more species in here. Let's get our habitat put down because we didn't do that this episode. And then we can work on maybe getting another exhibit that we can put. Um, maybe we take, maybe we make a path. We'll probably have to get power. We'll probably have to get power, which is fine. What's up here? Like, oh, okay. So we can actually build up here too. That's fine. But um, I'm likely thinking maybe get another path coming around here and then putting another habitat over here somewhere. Yeah, cool. All right, y'all. Well, I am going to end this episode here for our, what is this? Maple Leaf Wildlife Park Scenario Career Mode Part 1-ish thing. <laughs> But I'm proud. I'm proud. But I do hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please give it a thumbs up, comment, and subscribe. If I see more, I'll talk to you all later. Bye.